it's Sunday morning and we're doing a week in my life. I just changed into this little workout set. Both top and bottom are from the brand Story with an eye. I'm drinking my coffee. I just had a lovely morning getting my YouTube video up, watching some TV. Went out last night, landed from Charlotte yesterday, and we literally had so much fun. We never go out after live shows, and we did in Charlotte, and it was so worth it. It was so fun. But we're headed to Pilates this morning with my friend Mary Steven. I'm just obsessed with Pilates right now. I have a lot of random things I want to do today. Tonight are the Grammys, so I'm going to go to Delaney's and watch that. Also, Fashion Week is this coming week, so I want to do some prep and figure out all my looks. My skin's just craving this um, First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Cream. I feel like it's just that kind of vibe. But I'm excited for this Sunday because I'm not hungover and we're gonna just get some stuff done, some errands. I'm doing an exciting photo shoot this week so I need to get all my props and stuff that I wanna use for the photo shoot today. Or yeah, I wanna get that today. I also really, I keep wanting to go to Trader Joe's because I really wanna try the protein pancakes. I feel like that would be delicious, so. We've just got all kinds of random fun things. I can't believe I hadn't invested in a like thick black wool coat yet. These are so warm and this one has shoulder pads in it, which I love. It's definitely, this was definitely an investment piece. It's the Hailey Bieber wardrobe NYC one. I love how chic it like makes my workout outfit look, you know? Anyways, I'm totally late. I have to go. Back now, I just did a quick little grocery run. I wanted to get the stuff so I can make my smoothie at home. I used banana, almond milk, almond butter, this chocolate protein powder, and ice, and it's so good. I got some blueberries, eggs, so I can have some breakfast, carrots and hummus, my favorite snacks, and then I just cleaned them out of the low-fat good culture because I eat one a day, so. And Mary Steven and I also stopped in Sephora because I needed to get this jade roller for a shoot I'm doing this week. More to come on that. I got a mini one of the powders because I ran out of my big one. I was like, let me just get a mini one. Why not? I use it to set my under eyes. And then also this Tower 28 mini facial spray to spray on my face after I work out. I cannot get over the sun that is outside right now. I'm so motivated. So we're just gonna get right to it. We're gonna do laundry. We're gonna unpack. I didn't even make my bed this morning. I'm the worst, but it's a weekend, okay? And we're just gonna get our shit together. I have a super busy and an exciting and fun week ahead that I'm truly so excited for, but I will not be able to properly enjoy it and get it all done if I don't set myself up for success today. And I'm on a little bit of a, not a time crunch, but I am going over to Delaney's tonight to watch the Grammys. And I wanna be able to go over there and just veg out and chill. So we need to get a lot done so that when I go over there, I'm not like, oh my gosh, there's so much that's not done because I'm so excited for the Grammys. I am such an award show girly and so is Delaney. So it's just so lovely that since she's moved here, I have an award show buddy. <laughs> poppy cranberry fizz flavor and when my friend was over the other night she said this is prime real estate and it's hard to find this flavor now so i'm gonna really enjoy this one mm. box to the collection this one's from angeline's in charlotte because we were there last weekend and guys i really need to get another one of these i keep forgetting i always remember during this vlog clip and then i forget so i'm starting to do overflow here i think once it gets really overflowed then i'll be 
more pressure to order it. Will it look good if there's two of these? Like one on one side, this in the middle, and then one on the other side. Random little haul from Charlotte, went to Anthropology. I got these stunning earrings. I love this shape. And then I also got this like organic shaped earring. I hope they're not too heavy. That's why I got them. They felt pretty light. Also from Anthro and then from a boutique in Charlotte called Uniquities. Um, I got these to wear for the Super Bowl slash Georgia game slash Bucks games. All my teams are root for are red. So works out. As for the Super Bowl, I'm not particularly rooting for either team because I love both teams. Um, there's just a lot of wags I follow on them. So I'm here for either but this works for either team. I feel like these earrings. Anyways, and then this lovely follower at the Girls in the Go Live show gave me these bracelets. So sweet. So I'm just putting all this stuff away. Truly one of the best things I ever did, thanks to my dad's suggestion, was store extra toilet paper and paper towels behind my mirror. So I'm not constantly just buying like two packs and I have like a whole Costco store back here of my paper goods. We are all unpacked. First load of laundry. Oh, I don't even need a can opener. First load of laundry is in. Feeling in a good place. Now I'm gonna get on my computer, get ahead on some work for the week. Mainly look at my Google Calendar and plan everything. I'm gonna make this, um, I think it's Amy's is the brand, yeah. Amy's lentil vegetable soup. I love lentil soup, fun fact. You're like, that's a very fun fact, Danielle. Um, but this is thanks to Thrive Market because I ordered stuff the other day so I could have just like things in my pantry like snacks and soups, stuff like this. It's just always nice to have on hand. So I'm gonna pop this in the microwave. I also need to refill my supplements. Only like three days worth. I have four days worth still filled, but since it's gonna be a busy day ahead, I'm like, I need to just get on and do that. It's steamy. My mom makes a really good lentil soup, so we'll see how comparable this is. I, I think I might've had this lentil soup before or a different brand and it was pretty good. Oh, there's like green beans in it. I feel like this is pretty, pretty nutritious for you. Just some Sunday soup, cheers. I feel like it's gonna be hot, but it's actually really good. This is really good. This is gonna do the trick for me. This is my lunch. Just kind of getting ahead for the week, like I was saying, and I'm just feeling a little dehydrated because I traveled yesterday. I feel like that always kind of happens naturally because you don't want to like drink too much water because you don't have to keep getting up to go to the bathroom at the air on the airplane, like just the littlest of things. Anyways, I think that I'm gonna make an element because you guys know I ride or die for element. <laughs> It's always so important to replenish your electrolytes. Like honestly, last night, I don't even know if I said this. I went out last night. I was out till like 2 a.m. I'm so crazy. Um, but, and then I went out the night before that, like I was saying in Charlotte, we went out with a ton of you guys after the show, which was so fun. And I worked out this morning and I just am needing some replenishment. I'm in the mood for like a cozy little beverage while I do work on my computer. So Element has this amazing chocolate medley box here. It's so great. It has chocolate mint, chocolate chai, and chocolate raspberry. I tend to go for the chocolate mint. I haven't tried the chocolate raspberry yet. I can't lie because I'm just obsessed with the chocolate mint, but we're gonna try it today. It's meant to be served hot, which I think is so fun because usually when you think of Electrolytes are thinking of putting it in a cold drink, which I definitely do, but it's fun to switch it up And I love that element got creative with this This is a great way to like wind down for the day or start your day if you're like filling out your planner or your journaling I think it's so great. Like look at that. I also feel like when it's colder outside I'm not pulling to drink for water as much because I'm just not thinking about it However, it's so important especially for all you skiers out there the ones that are going into super high elevation You need to be staying hydrated. So it's so easy to just throw a couple Couple of these element packs in your suitcase in your bag so you have them on the go I literally bring them with me hot water is ready the most satisfying part literally it's giving hot chocolate with electrolytes in it a lot of you guys already know this but if you click the link down below and go to drinkelement.com slash Danielle Carolyn you can get a free sample pack with any purchase, which I think is so fun. So if there's a flavor that you're like, oh, I wanna try that, maybe it's you wanna try the chocolate medley, then you can also get a free sample pack with your purchase where you can try all the flavors. Like for me, my all-time favorite is citrus salt. But if you, so if you wanna try that and then you get a sample pack with all the other flavors, it's a great deal. Okay, let's try chocolate raspberry together. 
This might be my favorite one. I thought chocolate mint was my favorite. Wait, this one tastes the most like just normal hot chocolate to me. Wow, okay. I think this is my new favorite flavor. <laughs> so thank you so much to Element for sponsoring this video. It's always such a pleasure working with them because you guys know it's so infused in my routine. So it's exciting to work with them. I'll have the link down below. Element.com slash Danielle Carolyn. That's L-M-N-T dot com slash my name. I'll have it here on the screen. Get your free sample pack today. You guys are not going to regret it. You do not need to have to be an athlete to drink electrolytes. I'm such a fan. pulling all of the props if you will for a shoot that I'm doing this week I'm so so excited for this new series that I'm launching so I wonder if any of these props give you guys a little hint it's gonna be a short form series Ow, I'm so excited this is just a lovely little bunch of aesthetic things together right <laughs> watching the Grammys red carpet like live stream Ryan was here he actually brought me some flowers he's gotten so good at replenishing me once a week, which is really so sweet. And he just popped by and brought me flowers and we watched an episode of the morning show because it's like our new obsession. And we were just trying to make it work because I knew I had plans tonight. So very, very, very sweet. I showered and I'm about to head over to Delaney's apartment. And we just ordered Uber Eats Javelina um, to her apartment. It's, um, they have white queso. It's like the only place to find white queso. In New York City, I swear. And if you guys have any of the recommendations of where I can get that good, like, thin, like, drippy white queso, let me know. Because Havelina is the only place I've been able to find. Um, and Caitlin's coming now, too. So my two besties. I'm so excited. Um, and I'm just going to get these in some water, put on a sweatshirt, and head over to Delaney's. I know. I got the pint of the queso. And that's not like, oh my God, it's warm. You and, So I ended up getting chicken tacos. You and Caitlin got, oh, that's fun that they're crispy. I think this is mine. Oh, wow. Yeah. I like to have had rice and beans. Then you both got a side of rice. Yeah. Wow. I actually should have gone. I should have just gotten what you guys got. I got beans, but the crispy looks, I haven't had a crispy taco in a while, but it's fine. It's fine. We move. We move. Like taco, orange shell taco. No, because that's what it said. We're here. I am so excited. We're talking about all of our hypothesis for tonight. This is our Super Bowl. And then the Super Bowl is next Sunday. <laughs> Guys, I miss Miley Cyrus. It's so nice to see her on stage. Guys, we just saw Taylor Swift. She has a fan with her. So when she goes to talk to Jack Antonoff, you can't see her mouth. That was genius. Trevor Noah is a good host. Cause you guys care about my commentary. I'm like, so everyone knows this is my my take. Who comes? No, it's not even live. This is a week later. Holy shit! Flowers department. I'm gonna go and post the cover right now backstage. Oh my god! A new album? New album. Tortured poet. A brand new album. A oh new album. Look at everyone's so cute. Everyone's like, I thought you were gonna announce Reputation. Oh, I'm so confused. <gasps> I need to go oh on the internet right oh. now and see what everyone's saying. Wait, she definitely posted it by now. I bet she had someone on. Oh my god, she was so nervous. She was so nervous. Six degrees outside, so we're gonna bundle up. Guess who's going back to the aloe gym? This girl. <laughs> I'm going back in to do another Pilates with Astrid. I loved it. I'd never done like a semi private Pilates class before, and it's so nice the attention to detail. And like, she constantly would correct me and make sure my form was good, which I really appreciate, especially with something like Pilates, where it's very small little movements. But if you're not doing it right, I feel like it's not even effective. So pumped about that I'm wearing this black aloe sports bra it has like double straps there 
aloe leggings. I love. I'm pretty sure these are the airlift leggings. I love them. She gave them to me last week, so I'm gonna wear them. And yeah, we have a fun day ahead. I'm gonna take one last of my coffee, brush my teeth, and we're gonna head out the door. Stopped by Ralph to get a little hot tea. She was running late, so I was like, I'll get a little mint tea, no problem. Romanticize my morning. Watch people walk by me. <laughs> It's not too cold right now because I have the hot tea. today like I know my abs and inner thighs are going to be on fire tomorrow um I totally have brunch plans in an hour and a half but I simply need my post-workout cottage cheese as you know oh my gosh mm. Mm. just showered and we did a little half up half down situation and then later I might switch to a, a slick back bun. <laughs> um, but we're getting ready because we have a couple of things we're doing today. First, I'm going to Cafe Clooney in the West Village with Katie and Sarah, TBT Sarah Bell 93X. She's, I think her Instagram is Sarah Elizabeth. Anyways, you guys probably already all know her. Um, we've known each other forever and she moved to New York and we literally haven't seen each other since she's moved here, which is just criminal. So, me, her, and Katie. Wow, this smells so good. Nude sticks, Dolce Nude. Oh my gosh, it smells like an autumn candle. Um, we're going to brunch, and I'm so excited to catch up with her. She moved to Brooklyn, and she looks like she's really loving it. So, we wanted to make time to see each other. After that, I'll come home, get a little bit of stuff done, and then going to the podcast studio and recording an episode of Gals on the Go with Brooke because she'll be out of commission for a few days. She's getting her ears pinned back tomorrow. And I'm so excited for her because she's always been, especially in recent years, very self-conscious of her ears. And it genuinely makes me so sad. So I'm excited for her that she's doing something that is gonna make her feel even more confident and super happy and I can tell she's really excited. So um, we wanted to get the episode recorded today for next week since she'll, I think she has to wear a headband for like a week. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna continue getting ready and I'll show you guys my outfit. And then we're gonna go to Cafe Clooney. I'm so hungry still, so. I'm just sitting over here taking my sweet time and Katie texts, I'm walking over, see you guys soon. And I'm like, <laughs> what? I thought it was at 11.30 and they're like, no, it's 11. I don't know how I missed that because I am so good with my calendar and like, I don't know, know where I got 11.30 from, but good thing I already know what I'm wearing. I'm just gonna pop on my fur coat and maybe I'll just do sneakers and I'll run there. I live close so I can just walk there, but oh my God, shoot, shoot, shoot. No eye makeup is being done now. Um, whoops. That is such a loser move. I don't know how I did that. Is this okay? Is this okay? Okay. We will do more eye makeup later. That is okay. Wow. My new earrings for anthropology. I am so happy I got them. They're so cute. Lululemon top, Orium Collective belt, the Goldie jeans, brown Nike dunks, and then this is either gonna pull it all together or it's gonna look bad. So let's pray for looking good here. I almost like don't like the belt. Something's wrong with the belt here. I'm kind of thinking no belt, is that crazy? But then we have the bag and then we have the sunglasses. Yeah, I think we're going no belt. I don't know if that's like crazy take, but we're gonna head over, I'm so excited.
but this is better for on the go. Taking a picture of Katie, looking fab. Back down to earth. I'm listening to like, Oh gee, Justin Bieber, down to earth. Gosh, I just like need him to do a resurgence. I need a Justin Bieber concert in my life. I used to have a cardboard cutout of him in my room, just so we all know. With all that being said, by the way, I am back from brunch. It was so lovely. I can't believe I hadn't seen Sarah since she'd moved here. And I'm just getting some emails done, hence more coffee. And we're gonna go record a podcast. I hope I don't get copyrighted for this music. We're home now and I just got my Eat Clean Bro delivery. I freaking love this stuff. Audrey Challenger got me on it. I literally used her code. It's a ton of great pre-made meals. They're not frozen, they're freshly made. I may, I'm, in a, I'm in the city and they must have like a kitchen nearby or something because it, it's able for local delivery. They don't do added sodium. They use like grass-fed beef, stuff like that. And I just love what they're all about. And it's just been so easy for me recently um, to have these pre-made, really nutritious meals. So this one's like a Korean beef with broccoli and rice. And I've gotten it before and it's so good. And I've just been dreaming about, like they put sesame seeds on it and it's literally so good. So yeah, recording went well. And I'm just gonna eat and work. Okay guys, I'm off to Europe. <laughs> I'm totally kidding. Um, but we are leaving my apartment for a night, maybe two nights. Long story short, I am doing a shoot tomorrow in this beautiful hotel room at the Langham Hotel. I've had my eye on it for a while and um, it's for the series that I'm launching. And by the time this vlog is up, the it won't be announced just yet. I think it'll be announced in a couple days by the time you guys are watching this. And I just want you guys to see the promo video because I think it will explain everything more. Um, but maybe I'll show some behind the scenes. I don't really know. It's just fun to have a little secret project and be annoying, okay? Um, but yeah, I have all the props, all the clothes I need for this. Um, and I'm gonna head over to the hotel and the Langham Hotel is beyond kind and gave me the room to shoot in which is so nice and like obviously tagging them and everything and I needed it for tomorrow from like 10 to 12 to shoot in and She was like, oh, I'll just give it to you for two nights and I was like, oh my gosh, thank you So I'm gonna go over there tonight since I'm gonna wake up in the morning Kat's coming over to do my makeup and I mean you guys know how much I love a hotel so I'm so excited and I want to do some shooting while I'm there as well. Like, obviously, I have the thing in the morning, but then it'll be nice to just get some like work done and just be in a hotel room. And then um, I might come back over here at one point tomorrow, but then I think Ryan might come over either tonight or tomorrow night um, to sleep over because it's just so fun to have a hotel room together. So, really random, but it'll make sense soon. So, I'm excited. I just called my Uber and we're gonna head uptown. It's on Fifth Ave. I can't wait to see the room. I'll give you guys a room tour. I'm so excited. We have made it to the Langham. Everyone's so nice here. I wanna give you guys a little room tour. Absolutely obsessed with this kitchen. That's one of the reasons I wanted to shoot here because I'm going to utilize this. I mean, this is so stunning. Is this the refrigerator? Hallelujah. Is there not a coffee maker? Oh, okay, I was gonna say I would be shocked. A little Nespresso, can't wait to use that. And I didn't even realize this until just now, you guys. I was like, what is this door? There is a guest bathroom for all of my guests. <laughs> Moving on into here, this is the living room. I, it's, you guys will see the vision tomorrow um, cause it's like night out. So I feel like you can't really see the room, but look at this view of the Empire State Building. Don't mind me as I'm going to romanticize New York all day, all night. I love the, pl I love these wooden finishes. It's very in my vibe right now. Love how they decorated. It feels very homey, very much like an apartment, which I really like. And there's a little desk here too, which is nice. The big windows. I can't wait to see the lighting in here tomorrow. <laughs> We're on the 21st floor. The room, so lovely. Another reason I picked this hotel to shoot at is I loved the big, wooden backdrop. I just, I really love all the wood in this place. Also look at these bookshelves. It's just so beautiful. And then again, the big old windows, Empire State Building. I can't wait to wake up here tomorrow. I'm so, so excited. This just looks dreamy. Moving on over here, we have this ginormous mirror, which will be perfect for OOTDs. Like 
I want to film some TikToks in here. I feel like it's so beautiful. My suitcase, of course. I'm guessing this is another closet. Washer, dryer. All right. What's here then? Now I'm just so curious. Walk-in closet. Some more closet space. Or I don't even know what that is. Bathroom. So, so beautiful. The bathtub is beautifully set up. I'm going to have to take a bath, I think, with the tray and everything. The shower. She's a beaut. The overhead shower. What products do they use here? <gasps> it's Diptyque. It's Diptyque. Wow. That's amazing. It's a really pretty piece of artwork above the toilet. And then we have this little area. There's a little stool to do your makeup. I love it. I am so excited. Of course, some white hotel robes, very important. Also, they left these beautiful cookies for me. I mean, this is screaming my name. I heard New York, Empire State Building, the Langham. Am I saying it right, the Langham, Langham? Those are so freaking cute. Anywho, I'm gonna get settled in. I wanna get some work done. I purposely came here a little bit earlier. It's like seven, um, which is definitely still working hours. So I'm gonna get a lot of scheduling done and kind of hang everything up for tomorrow, prep everything. I am obsessed with this mirror. I wish this was my apartment. This is so cool. are getting sleepy but I'm hungry like should I order room service I think Ryan is coming over tonight and I don't think it, like sometimes when I'm hungry before bed I'm like let me just go to bed but I feel like I, he's not gonna be here for another hour so I'm like should I order a margarita pizza maybe because they have that on the room service menu also I set up my little products here and my props how sexy that looks. All my cute, fun little girly things here. I sprayed some like tan lux, the water, the tan water. And I think the tan is coming in quite nicely. I like had my spray tan from the Charlotte shows last week. And I didn't want to scrub it off because it was still looking good because I've been moisturizing. So I like sprayed on the water. Also, random side note, been loving this Kopari Ultra Restore Firming Body Serum. Feels really nice on my body. <laughs> I really don't know what to do. You know, like when you can't fall asleep because you're hungry, I feel like that's my vibe right now. And I already ate some Pringles <laughs> from the mini bar. What else is over here? Oh, I, tomorrow's Kat's birthday. And when I booked her for this shoot, she didn't tell me at first. And then she was like, okay, I'm gonna tell you because I know you'd want to know, like it is my birthday, but I still really want to do the shoot. I was like, so I got her some Baked by Melissa cupcakes earlier. I'm gonna give that to her tomorrow. And her and I both love, um, smoothies from juice generation so i'm gonna order her one in the morning so it's here when she gets here nothing really is tickling my fancy over here some nuts hopefully it's not one of those things where you pull it up and it's magnetic and then it charges you i don't think so oh if you need a phone charger that's amazing oh and they just gave me water I didn't realize that was there. I can't wait to make coffee here in the morning. I'm just so excited to wake up here. I'm like ready for tomorrow. It's like Christmas morning. I need to kind of tidy up in here a little bit. I ate one of those cookies. <laughs> um, updates to come on if I order room service or not. Uh, no lemon is needed. Thank you though. Okay, thank you. I really appreciate it. Okay, great. Thank you so much. See you then. I did it. We went hard. I got pizza and I got a side of the shoestring fries and hot chamomile tea to balance it all out. Cause I just want to, this is so, <laughs> I have to take advantage. And then we'll go to bed. I want to see if this TV, I can get um, Netflix on or anything. Oh, I've been settled. Whoa, this bed's really bouncy. <laughs> I want to see if I can get like Netflix or any of those things on this TV so I can watch my shows or I bet I could do like Google cast or cast from my computer Or I could just watch on my computer. <gasps> oh my gosh <laughs> Let's see Oh my gosh, that looks amazing. He said this is fresh off the oven, so I need to be careful Oh Baby, that looks amazing 
it's so sweet he pulled up this chair but I don't think I'm gonna sit here I'm gonna bring it to the bed of course but I need to be careful since I'm like shooting in this place tomorrow I can't be getting pizza on the on the, on the duvet cover over there oh my gosh this is just stunning and my hot tea ah amazing amazing part two this is a risk maybe I should move that table over here <laughs> gonna close these curtains I think I can just do this oh wow I feel bougie <laughs> good night guys big day tomorrow I'll see you in the morning just healing. This makes me want to live in a high rise. Like this view is so sick. Good morning, New York City. This reminds me of when I would come and visit New York because I typically would stay in Midtown and ah! photo shoot time. The calm before the storm. I need to like clean it up in here. Like I need the steam from the shower to go away because we're shooting in here. I wish there was a way I could put up those blinds. The windows are so pretty, um, but hung up some of the stuff I'm wearing. I'm hoping I can make the bed in a similar fashion that it was made yesterday because it looked so good and I didn't want to ruin it, but here we are. I also ordered Kat her favorite smoothie from Juice Generation. Hopefully she didn't already get it. I'm going to put it in the fridge. She loves the PB split. I'll surprise her with the smoothie and the cupcakes. We have a whole crew coming this morning too. I have... Kat doing my makeup, Jackie doing my hair, Katie's doing video, Alex, Shots by Alex is doing f photo, and then um, I have someone from my team coming, and then our, my assistant. So, it's gonna be busy! Oh my gosh, I can smell the bacon. This is the most beautiful setup. Again, he put a chair here. I'm so dead, it's so cute. I guess I will just sit here. Hallelujah. Look at the avocado with the flower. And then of course the bread, my decaf coffee. That's what I'm going for first. Cat's here, Miss Birthday Hi. Girl! I'm so excited. Good vibes today. Good vibes. <laughs> to see what this is all about. Um, it was just fun to have a nice creative outlet and be just around a ton of amazing creatives. Clara Purse is in town, I'm so excited, and she's nearby, so she's gonna come up, see the room, well, she's just putting stuff down, then we're gonna go walk around and shop, and she's here! I'm vlogging. Hello! Hello. Oh, come on in! Thank you. You look this fabulous! Is... Hey. Obsessed. Little outfit change. I decided I'm gonna stay here another night and Ryan's gonna sleep over tonight. It'd be so fun. Um, so I'm just wearing my favorite. This is like my go-to outfit combo right now. This black skims top, oversized blazer, a statement belt or just a belt of any kind. This one's Orient Collective. By the way, anything I ever talk in my vlogs, I talk about in my vlogs, I always have linked below. My favorite are Gold Day jeans, this little YSL bag. And then I'll either do black boots or black slingback like pointed toes. And it looks so good, so chic. So put together and you can wear this outfit so many times and 
I feel like people don't realize because it's just like a go-to basic. So I'm going to dinner. I'm going with Kat for her birthday. We're going to Balthazar. I'm so excited. She loves that place and wanted to go. And I was like, we gotta go. It's your birthday. So we're gonna go to dinner. And then we're gonna pick up Ryan along the way and he's gonna come back here and have a little staycation together. It'll be so fun. <laughs> Such a random vlog this is. All right, we both got burgers. We're very, very excited. Happy birthday, dear cat. Happy birthday to you. Yay! Oh, it's beautiful. <laughs> Yummy, make a wish. Yay! Ryan's here and I'm showing him all the features. How there's a TV literally in the mirror. And then the view. So cool. You can't really see it, the reflection. You like it? Yeah. Pretty nice spot. They did a uh, turn down service while I was gone. They closed all the curtains and I was like, no, I want Ryan to see the view. And they turned on smooth jazz. They, uh, it's just, put the slippers. Fancy hotels are just fancy. Wow. That is a wrap for this vlog. I really enjoyed it. I feel like it was very fun, very different, dynamic, lots of different things going on. Stay tuned for the next vlog because it is going to be fashion week, baby. I start fittings tomorrow and then events the next day. So we are hitting the ground running. I'm very, very, very excited to take you guys along. And none of this would be possible without you guys. So I absolutely love you guys so much. Thanks so much for always hanging out. And subscribe if you're new here to be notified every time I post a new vlog. And I'll see you next time. Bye. Thank mm -hmm. you.